All right, the South Island State Championship is this weekend and temperatures are freezing. Luckily, here's a dumpster fire of a video to warm you up for this weekend's championship with the top five things that you can expect to see. Number five. Number five is Team Hoonhae shitting the bed. Look, this joke is as tired as the team is, but that's why it's coming in at number five. Admittedly, they have been turning up to events recently, so maybe we can see them make it past round three, perhaps? Instead of the standard 0-2 pump. Number four. Damage Step Rulings. With the rise of Tempire Dragons, Damage Step Rulings knowledge is now mandatory in the Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG, just like personal hygiene was a couple of years back. Oh, it's always been mandatory, but, you know, officially. Simply knowing of either of these is no longer good enough for a passable tournament experience. Unstinky your brain and unstinky your ass for everyone's sake. Speaking of which, number three. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? This smells great. Do you know what doesn't? You. Brush your teeth, shower, deodorant, and not just this week, every day. Number two. While international results will like you to think that every second duelist in the world is on Snake Eyes, us here in little old New Zealand, New Zealand. have a very different idea of what meta is, as well as hygiene. Recent local results have seen Yubel, Ragnarika, and even Crystal Beast take top spots. Did you know Kiwis also rank amongst some of the highest depression statistics in the world? Where was I going with this? Oh yeah. Prepare for meta decks. But expect everything. I think Carmen San Diego said it best. It's a Carmen San Diego special. Steak car car. Number one. Number one. Time. We've been under the updated end of match procedure rules for almost six years now. That's one more than I've got fingers. Unless you're from like further south. I only just moved here. I didn't wasn't born here. And you've had time. <laughs> to familiar yourself with these rulings, so keep an eye on the clock. This includes watching for opponents slow playing and taking too long to make a play. You have to say something. Look, I'm an old man now, I don't have much time left, I'm already going to die playing this game anyway, I just don't want it to be this weekend. So you best believe I will call out opponents if they're taking too long in the tank to make a decision. I'm not saying be a dick and make them play like they've already been huffing at the after party. <laughs> just a quick. Oh, hey bro, do you mind making a move? Oh, uh-huh, yeah, 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 sure, sure, sure. But if they're playing too slow, that like you might need to check the signs of life, then yeah, call a judge to resuscitate their plays. And that's it, that's another five things you can expect to see this weekend. Look forward to seeing many of you as possible at the event. I'll be on the judge team and not playing, so that means that you have a shot at the title. Kakite and catch you Sunday. Pew. Number four. Maybe I should hold up four when I say four instead of number four. Number four. Did it again. Number four. 